Yeah, they look distracted, far off, distant. I mean, it seemed like their heart wasn't in it to try to win that game. Pass to DeRozan. Over Vanderbilt. And DeRozan with the basket. On the assist by Vucevic. Boy, Vucevic, so solid in all fundamentals of the game. And really an outstanding passer for a big guy. And a different kind of score. DeRozan attempted 741 mid-range jumpers last year. Almost 300 more than anyone else. Ball outside. Back to Levine. Kicks it to DeRozan. Outside Levine. Five on the clock. Caruso finds ball from the arc. Sinks it from distance. And Grant DeRozan, high volume from the mid-range and extremely accurate. You know, B.A., he consistently makes about half those shots. And defensively, you know that's his favorite area. But his ball handling and vertical negate anything you throw at him. Chicago trailing here. Vucevic in the post. Davis on him. Here's James. And it's James with the jam. Getting ideal positioning and using it to capitalize on the offensive glass, that's evidence of the strength that LeBron James has. Back to ball. Pass to Vucevic. Shoots over Davis. And Chicago again with a bucket. Boy, at the offensive end, his game is so impressive. I mean, he's a threat every time up the floor. James passes to Russell. And count the basket. He was fouled. And he's going to the line for one more. So Chicago going with an almost entire new group here. Drummond's checked in for Vucevic. Williams comes in for Levine. The Sumu, he's checked in for Caruso, and it's Beverly in for ball. As it's always good to see a young player start to mature in front of our eyes, and Russell has been that kind of guy. He's done a great job figuring out how to become a better leader. Back to Beverly. Up and over Russell. Beverly shot off. He expects to make every one of those, and we expect him to make them too. Left side, Russell. Here's Reeves. And again, the Lakers, no good. The Bulls have gone three of four. Off to a nice start. Back on draft night, 2017. The Bulls trading away their star, Jimmy Butler. And what a haul they got from Minnesota. Zach Levine, the headliner. And he's turned out to be a franchise player. It's tough to win one of those type of deals, but Chicago got a stud. And the basket by DeSumo. Just straight tricking the defender with the shot fake. This is how it's done. A minute 29 left in the first. Here's Reeves. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. The three ball. That shot off. The Bulls have gone four or five so far. Looking sharp. Pass to DeSumo. The three. A rebound by Beasley. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 4 from deep to start this one. Here's Reeves. Out to Beasley. To the middle. Launches a three. The shot that time not on target. Now Chicago takes it the other way. DeRozan outside. Outside, Williams. Puts it up from 17. And DeRozan with the basket. On the assist from Williams. DeRozan's got his second bucket on the night. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. Pass to Reeves. Back to Russell. Now here's Hachimura. The Lakers with another miss. Now Drummond. He's guarded by Beasley. From 10 feet away. Can't get it to drop. It's all tied in Chicago. And the second quarter is on its way when we return. Close 
game underway so far. We'll see if either of these teams can jump out ahead of the second quarter. And guys, what's your take on the Bulls so far? Give it up for their D. They're battling, communicating, and coming up with key stops. They've got them rattled. It's only the first quarter, and already they've made enough big plays on defense to last really an entire game. Williams at power forward with Vucevic at center. Alex Caruso is out there with ball. And it's Levine in at the small forward position. That's the five out there for the Bulls. Beasley for three. That falls. Nice feed that time from James. James has got his fourth assist in this one. LeBron led the NBA in assists during his 2020 title season with the Lakers becoming the second oldest player ever to lead the league in that category. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. Levine, a primetime threat to knock down those mid-range jumpers. Now James. He's coming off a 40-point game against Denver. And rebounded by Zach Levine. Man, that assist title for LeBron. An incredible accomplishment for someone of his size, Clark. I bet you didn't know this, B.A., or maybe you did, because you are a factoid machine, but the only <laughs> player taller than LeBron to lead the league in assist, Wilt Chamberlain, when you throw in winning the bubble championship finals MVP, 2020 might have been LeBron's finest season. Stolen by Davis. That one doesn't drop. Nice D from Vucevic. And they're dialed in offensively. Sure are. Staying in attack mode and at the same time playing under control. Williams' shot is good. Setting each other up beautifully. I love it. Eight of their last ten points coming off assist. You know nothing makes a coach happier than selflessness on the basketball court. Here's Hachimura. And it's slammed in by Hachimura. Really doesn't matter what position LeBron is playing. The point, the four or the five, James changes games with his passing ability. Ball outside. Pass to Caruso. Now Levine. On the wing, Levine. Over James. And the Bulls tack on two more. And when Ball has the ball, it's in good hands. He can run the offense, no doubt. And he lobs it up. Oh, got a piece of it. And that'll be Los Angeles ball as it goes out of bounds. Lakers able to keep the possession. He clipped the ball there, but not enough to nab the steal. Clearly a careless pass. He got away with one there. Vanderbilt's checked in for the Lakers. Back to James. Outside Schroeder. Pass to James. Three-pointer, no good. You know, he's not a knockdown shooter from there, but when you're that uncovered, you almost are forced to take it. And it's James with the jam. You know, Beasley not trying to do too much or get too cute there. Just um, finding the open man in a simple fashion. Well done. Ball passes to Caruso. Three-pointer. Yes, sir. And it's Ball with the assist that time. Ball's got his third assist of the night. And in any season, you'll have your struggling teams. Clark is a competitor. How hard is it to bring your best when you're enduring a tough stretch? Well, I think it comes down to the responsibility you have to yourself and your team to give it your best shot. And competitors want to compete, and you have to relish that, even when you have the deck stacked against you. So weathering adversity and still being professional and committed to competing, I think is the mark of every pro, should be the mark of every pro. Schroeder goes up and lays it in nice and easy. I mean, they've been relentless. Just keep getting shots at the rim. Well, the defensive rotations have been a step slow. It's really helped them get that ball inside time after time. A big group substitution here for Chicago. Andre Drummond is checked in for Vucevic. DeMar DeRozan comes in for Williams. Desumu, he's checked in for Caruso. And it's Beverly in for ball. Drummond passes to Levine. Back to Drummond. Over Bamba. The shot by Drummond. No good. Los Angeles has gone one for three from downtown here in the second. Pass to Vanderbilt. Out to James. Let's the three fly. 
Not going to go that time. And it's Chicago the other way. Boy, this is um, bad. Tough to watch. I mean, this is really bad. He's stone cold this boy. Man. The Lakers trail. As for the Lakers, you think this is the last team LeBron plays for? You know, B.A., he certainly wants to play with his son. We know that. Now, whether that's in the purple and gold, only time will tell. It would definitely be fun to see them both with this story franchise. Kicks it to DeRozan. Inside. Here's Drummond. Sinks that one after missing his first two attempts. Now one for three. That's where Drummond generates most of his offense. I mean, he's got a lot of moves in the low post. Pass to Vanderbilt. And Vanderbilt slams it in. Boy, nice timing on these jumps. He's somewhat on the small side for a power forward, but he just never gives up. On the wing, Levine. Checked by James. Levine, that one's good. He's finally leaving that dismal first quarter behind him. Took him a while to get going. Out left to the wing. Russell from outside. Rebound by the Bulls. 36 seconds left to play in the second quarter. Here's Levine. Misses the jumper. The Lakers have gotten six shots to fall out of 13 attempts here in the second. That one drops for him. All five guys are in sync. Their ball movement is flawless. The last five trips they've had have ended with a great pass leading to a basket. They're really sharing the sugar. Here's DeRozan. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. DeRozan's got his third bucket of the night. James passes to Bamba. And it's Bamba finishing strong. Boy, I tell you, Bamba's wingspan and his standing reach is ridiculous. This dude was born to throw it down. And a pretty tightly contested game here as we end the first half. Pulls out. All right, good stuff, Allie. And we'll get back to the... And as we welcome you to the studio, we call you a check. Did you enjoy testing your star? Let's switch gears to the Chicago Bulls. They're in a tight one after the first. And that is going to do it for us. Let's get back. And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. Zach Levine with a strong contribution so far in this one. Yeah, they've done an amazing job of creating room to operate for them. And then, of course, executing. And you know what? It helped that they had a few guys with very hot hands on the perimeter, too. Here's who Darvin Ham is starting in the second half. We've got LeBron James, Jared Vanderbilt out there with Davis. Then it's D'Angelo Russell, and it's Reeves in at the two. You know what? The size ball possesses guys as a point guard is really a nice asset, especially when the defense tries to be physical. Down low, Davis. But with the explosive leaping ability, he's able to play center despite being undersized. Chicago leading, and Anthony Davis on the NBA's top 75 list. Brad, do you think that was a controversial selection? Well, I mean, it was mostly due to how young Davis still is. You can't argue with the all-NBA selection of numbers. And of course, being a recent champion may have put him over the top. There's no stopping that. A.D. is too long and strong to bother that alley-oop. Pass to Vucevic. Ball with it. Guarded by Russell. Three-pointer Vucevic. Vanderbilt pulls it in. Vanderbilt's got four rebounds in the game. They are looking really strong offensively. Yeah, just terrific momentum. Let's see if they can keep it up. And how. I mean, they're taking this defense to task, taking them to school. Every one of their last 10 points have come in the paint. Caruso, pass to Levine. Pulls up. And again, no good by Chicago. Far from an ideal start here. I mean, this half just one for four so far. The shot by Reeves, no good. The Bulls have gotten only one of four shots to fall in the second half. Levine passes to Vucevic, shoots over Davis, and Vucevic gets it to go on the assist by Levine. You know, the mid-range game, guys, is really one of Nikola Vucevic's strong suits. I mean, you've got to play him honest if you're a defender. They get it back. Davis. 
Oh, it's blocked by Levine. And that one goes out of bounds. Last touch by Levine. Williams has checked in for Zach Levine. Achimura has checked in for Los Angeles. Schroeder comes in for Reeves. Russell, the pass to Davis. And Davis slams it home. Boy, the former second overall pick has really worked on his passing. That was an outstanding find by Russell. From the wing, William Schott is good. And the Bulls lead by two. Second half of play here. We're just under two and a half minutes past. Russell, the pass to Davis. To the paint. Here's Schroeder. Williams grabs the board. That's a rarity for him, especially against the soft defense. Pass to Caruso. Over Schroeder. No good there. And Los Angeles the other way now. And just one of the most impressive titles in league history, guys. The 2020 Lakers winning it all in the Orlando bubble. A testament to LeBron James and that team. It's been a dominant night for him, staying productive throughout. Vucevic finds DeRozan. And here is Williams. Takes the three. Yes, great play by DeRozan to set him up. DeRozan's got three assists in the game. You know, that 2020 bubble title for the Lakers. What made it so difficult? You know, B.A., the mental grind of all that time in the bubble. Three months in the same place. NBA players are used to being in four cities in a week. So it really was a different kind of challenge for them. The mid-range jumper isn't the most popular shot these days, but it's working for them. I love that mid-range shot. It's definitely giving the defender something extra to think about. I just love the aggressive finish. Now I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. That's exactly how you send it. Two hands and down. Here's DeRozan. And he gets it to go, hitting off the back of the rim. DeRozan's got 10 points in the game. They're going old school out there now. Working the mid-range part of the floor. They keep pulling up and watching them go down. It's a really nice thing to see. And book it for Vanderbilt. One reason this game is so tight is because both teams are hitting the boards with reckless abandon. The battle to a standstill on the boards has really been something to watch. And the game's not over yet. We'll see if one of these teams maintains more energy than the other going down the stretch. To the inside. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. DeMar DeRozan picks one up. You look at AD, and you know he's taken a share of contact over the course of his career. And quite honestly, that just comes with the territory when you're a dominant offensive player like him. Some changes for Chicago. Drummond's checked in for Nikola Vucevic. The Sumu comes in for Caruso. And it's Beverly in for Ball. Bamba's checked in for the Lakers. Beasley comes in for Russell. Beverly shot off. The Lakers have gotten 7 of 14 attempts to fall in the half. And he lobs it up to the rim. Well, I tell you what, it's rare that you see a big man with offensive skills like Davis has. He is a talented, rare player. The Rosen outside. Pass to Williams. There's 53 seconds left in the third quarter. Hits the trifecta. You got to be in awe of what he's doing this quarter, actually destroying the opponent. Outside Schroeder. On the wing, Davis. Rebound by the Bulls. And unlike some other guys, missing a wide open look won't hurt his confidence at all. Here's Beverly. And there's another one for the Bulls. The Lakers have gone 50% from the field in the third quarter. 8 of 16. With the 10-footer, shots good by Schroeder. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. And on the flip side, the defenders have to show more fight on the interior. They've got to offer more resistance here. Offensive board. Pass to DeSumo. Takes a three. That one falls. Coming off a drum and feed. The soon moves got five. You know, as you add experience, you start to see the floor better. That was a sweet find by Drum. And so it's Chicago leading by six as we wrap up the quarter. What has them in front right now, by and large, they're Please give a big round of applause. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist to the game. 
And the winner today, coming from an unlikely position, is the big fellow with the sweetest pass of the day. Boy, that's a nice asset to have. It's a huge boost to any offense, too. It adds a whole nother dimension when you've got a big guy that can pass. Well, what a terrific game it's been so far. With this fourth quarter sure to bring more pressure-packed basketball. They've got DeMar DeRozan. Ball is out there with Alex Caruso. Then there's Nikola Vucevic, and it's Levine in at the small forward position. That's the five out there for the Bulls. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. He made that drive look easy, but that had a high degree of difficulty. He established his position with a strong base. You got to box out Vucevic better than that. James, a screen on ball. Russell, double team. Inside, here's Bamba, and it's Bamba finishing strong. Man, where's the effort on the defensive end? you got to play harder than that. And you know, it's made for a fun game, but you're right. You're exactly right. I mean, the defense has been non-existent. Vucevic's shot is off. The Lakers trail. James passes to Russell. Back to James. Bamba, the screen on Caruso. From 12 feet. Misses off the right iron. Chicago has gone 5 of 8 from outside the three-point line in this one. Here's Ball. Outside for Levine. Over James. And Levine gets it to go on the assist by Vucevic. That's a heads-up play right there. Reads the floor, distributes accordingly. To the paint. Here's Bomba. Oh, my God. Oh, just a shot. hard on that one, B.A. Oh, save that for the dunk contest. That flush was so extra. Whether or not this game is close, he's the same guy. Focused on finishing firm at the rim. Well, I tell you what, guys. The kids, the young kids like to say, that's doing too much. That falls into that category. That was too much. Vanderbilt's checked in for Achimura. All right, let's get a report from Ali. Thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Billy Donovan was saying to the team. He told them, quote, play as if it's 0-0. We want that type of energy and focus. We might be winning, but this game is not over yet. It's a clear message, guys. All right, Ali, thanks once again. The shot by Russell, no good. The Bulls have got three of six shots to go in this fourth quarter. Pass the ball. Back to DeRozan. Yes, sir, and it's Ball with the assist that time. And it's an eight-point Chicago lead. Rosen is a man on a mission tonight. I don't know if I've ever seen DeMar any sharper than this. Bamba, screen on Levine. James passes to Bamba. It's scooped up! The Bulls have gone four of seven from the field in the fourth quarter. Puts one up from 19. And the Bulls tack on two more. Postcard perfect. That's how pretty the jump shot is by Vucevic. And for the Lakers, they're shooting 47% in this one. Looking efficient. James inside. He's covered by Levine. Strong performance from him. But he may need to do even more if they're going to win this game. DeRozan for three. And again, it's Chicago with a three. And they keep attacking from the three-point range here in the second half. Yeah, I have no problem with that. As a matter of fact, I hate to see teams get conservative with the lead. As long as they're good shots, take them. And as long as they're falling, continue to take them. Boy, you got to love that assist by LeBron. Vanderbilt against DeRozan. And again, it's Chicago. With a three. This is what it's been since halftime. Remarkable results from downtown. Boy, it's been a three point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. James with the ball. He's picked up by Levine. Right wing. Here's Reeves. Trying to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Fires from the wing. And he knocks the jumper down. Levine's got four points in the quarter. Well, you can see the athleticism there. I mean, Levine able to stop, gather, and pop in one fluid motion. I know it looked easy, folks, but that's athleticism and giftedness right there. And the Lakers making a change here. Davis has checked in. 152 left in the fourth quarter. Pass to Vanderbilt. And again, no good. 
by the Lakers. Chicago has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. Levine can't hit. The Lakers have got five out of ten shots to drop here in the final quarter. Russell to pass to Vanderbilt. And Vanderbilt slams it in. Such confidence as a passer. He hits guys in stride and makes it look easy. Here's Levine. Yes, sir. And it's Ball with the assist that time. Ball's got six assists now in the game. Here's James. 119 left to play in the fourth quarter. And finished off by Davis. <laughs> Gliding the pass to where it needed to be. Wow, a strong finish to seal the deal. And that's an alley-oop that'll be loop-to-loop -loop all day long on the highlight reel. And they just continue to attack, even late in the game, while they're up big. Now, I don't think you want to get loose and sloppy or ease up, but it is time for them to start using that clock a bit. Well, with a comeback out of range, you can put a bow on this one. Good performance for the Bulls. Man, they were in a groove from long range tonight. Yeah, they were able to find space, and they were ready to let it fly the moment they saw an open. And their efforts tonight pushed them to 41 wins on the year so far. And by picking up a hard-earned win tonight, they've captured the deciding game in the season series, finishing 2-1 to one against the Lakers. And what a huge performance it was for DeMar DeRozan. He was just everywhere for them on both ends, really. Just showing a lot of aggressiveness and intensity. Now here's Ball. And here's Levine. Down to five on the shot clock. Caruso. And Chicago again with a bucket. This is what winning is all about. Playing your best when it matters most. Yeah, you know, once they got victory in their view, a huge injection of energy and a great run to finish it off. Davis can't hit. Levine with it. Here's Vucevic. No good with the elbow jumper. So no problem for Chicago as they get the win. Showing that they're the far superior team. They win it going away. I'll tell you what. Give it up for their fans. They love to watch this team dominate. You best believe they're all going home happy tonight. All right, now let's check in with Allie. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thanks for that. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast.